Hey y'all, Coasters and Travels here. I'm at work as usual. <laughs> um, we just got some breaking news from Busch Gardens, Tampa Bay. Um, so for those who may not know this, or for those who have not been watching my past couple of videos, Scorpion at Busch Gardens, Tampa Bay will be permanently closing. Um, it's been operating at the park for 44 years. It's been operating since 1980. Busch Gardens, Tampa is a year round park. So you can just imagine all the wear and tear it endured throughout the years. And the original date it was supposed to close was September 2nd, which was um, pretty last minute. We got the um, the first set of news like a week, you know, about two weeks or so before it was supposed to close. It was supposed to close originally September 2nd, but I guess due to guest feedback, they extended the closure until September 8th. So you now have until September 8th to get your final ride on Scorpion. Now I understand for those, this may be a last, it still may be last minute, but for those who may want to try to make it to the park, this is your chance. You have one more week. I just want to repeat myself again. The park has extended the closure until September 8th. So share this video, get this video out to people who was a fan of Scorpion and thought they may not have enough time. Well, they have an extra week to do it. And I'm kind of glad for Busch Gardens for um, you know, extending the closure date because when we first got the news that Scorpion was closing, it threw everybody off. It threw me off. I had no idea that um, Scorpion was even on the chopping block, you know, because a couple years ago, people was talking about Kumba being on the chopping block, but it ended up being Scorpion. And, you know, that kind of makes me wonder what's going to happen with Kumba, because with Busch Gardens closing all these rides, last year they closed Sand Serpent. This year they're going to close Scorpion. So it makes me wonder what's going to happen with Kumba. And I'm, I'm pretty sure something something's going to, I'm pretty sure we're gonna get news about that probably in the future sometime, but um, anyway, back to Scorpion. Um, I'm happy that they're extending the ride for those who enjoyed the ride. I know there was a, it was a lot of people's first time riding it. For me, I don't really have any sentimental value with Scorpion. Really, I have more sentimental value with Python more than Scorpion, but um, it's still sad as a roller coaster enthusiast, it's still sad to see a roller coaster go away regardless. So yeah. This is just a really short video. Make sure you share this to people who may want to know this news. If you enjoyed this little quick news bit and you want to see more and you want to support the channel, make sure you like this video and consider subscribing to Coasters and Travels. That will help me greatly. Well, time to go back to work. Take care.